what we will learn today today we will learn and solve self practice exercise questions for c questions 1 to 7 of chapter integers and topics are addition of integers adding integers on number line adding integers using absolute values and adding three or more integers let's solve some questions Now we solve question number one, and question number one is determine whether the sum is positive or negative or zero. First bit is twenty plus sixteen. Both are positive integers. Twenty and sixteen are positive integers, so their sum will be positive. B minus twenty one plus minus nine. Both are positive negative integers. Minus twenty one and minus nine are negative integers, so their sum will be negative. C seventy plus minus twenty two. Both are of opposite sign integers, so the sign will be the sign of the bigger number. Here, bigger number is 70. 70 is greater than 22, so bigger number is 70, and bigger num sign of bigger number is positive. 70 is positive integer, so their sum will be positive. Now we solve question number two, and question number two is write addition expression represented by the number line. This is the given number line. Starting from zero, the number goes to right hand side with five place. Zero to five, distance from zero to five is five. And from starting from five, the number goes to right hand side to three place. Five plus three, and the number st uh, starting from five. Five to six one plus six to seven two plus and six to seven to eight is three plus five plus three and the number now at eight so number five plus three equal to eight so addition expression will be five plus three equal to eight. Now we solve question number second bit B and this is the given number line starting from zero to the number goes to right hand side zero to four four plus. Distance from zero to four is four, and from four the number goes to right hand and left hand side with seven place. As it is, as it goes from left hand side, the minus will be minus sign will be there. Then minus seven, then four plus minus seven equal to four two three one place one three two 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 place two two one three place. One to zero four plus four zero to minus one five plus minus one to minus two six plus and minus two to minus three seven plus. So the four plus minus seven equal to the number now at minus three. So four plus minus seven equal to minus three. So addition expression will be four plus minus seven equal to minus three. Now we solve question number three. Question number three is using the number line, write the following integers. First bit is five more than two. Five is positive integer, so starting from zero, the number goes to right hand side, zero to five, and distance from zero to five is five. Then more than, more than is plus. Starting from five, 
the number goes to right hand side with two two plus then 5 to 6 1 plus 6 to 7 2 plus then 5 plus 2 the number now at 7 so then 5 more than 2 will be 5 plus 2 equal to 7 now second bit b 7 more than minus 2 7 is positive integer so starting from 0 the number goes to right hand side with 7 plus and distance from 0 to 7 is 7 Then now the number is at seven. More than minus two. More than means plus. So from seven back to the left hand side is minus two negative sign, negative integer. So from starting from seven, the number goes to left hand side with two plus. Seven to six one plus six to five two plus. So number now at five. So seven plus minus two equal to five. Seven more than minus two will be seven plus of minus two equal to five. Now third bit C. Eight less than three. Eight. Eight is positive integer. So starting from zero, the number goes to eight place. So now the number is at eight. Distance from zero to eight is eight. Now number at eight and from number eight. The number eight less than three. Starting from eight, the number goes to right hand, left hand side, which three plus minus three. So eight to seven, one plus seven to six, two plus seven and six to five, three plus. So eight plus minus three equal to five. So number now number eight five. So eight less than three will be eight plus of minus three equal to five. Now we solve question number four, and question number four is using the number line to find the following sum. First bit is five plus four. Both are positive integers, so starting from zero, the number goes to right hand side. As as both are positive integers, so zero to five. Distance from zero to five is five. Now the number at five and five plus four. Starting from five, the number goes to four plus. Five to six, one plus six to seven, two plus seven to eight, three plus and eight to nine, four plus. The number now at nine. So five plus four equal to nine. Now second bit B six plus of minus four. Six is positive integer. So starting from zero, the number goes to right hand side. Zero to six, six plus. So now the number at six. Distance from zero to six is six, and um, six plus minus four. The number goes to minus four is negative integer, so number goes from six to left hand side with four plus six to five one plus five to four two plus four to three three plus and three to two four plus. So six plus of minus four equal to two. The number now at two, so six plus minus four equal to two. Now e minus two plus seven plus minus three. Minus two is a negative integer, so starting from zero, the number goes to goes to left hand side. Is minus two is negative integer, so starting from zero, the number goes to right left hand side, which two plus zero to minus one, minus one to minus two, and start and distance from zero to minus two is minus two, so minus two plus then seven. Seven is positive integer, so from Starting from minus two, the number goes to right hand side with seven plus minus two to minus one one plus 
minus 1 to 0, 2 plus 0 to 1, 3 plus 1 to 2, 4 plus 2 to 3, 5 plus 3 to 4, 6 plus and 4 to 5, 7 plus. Number now at 5, minus 2 plus 7 is 5. Now number at 5, then 5, then plus minus 3. Then starting from 5, the number goes to left hand side is minus 3. This is negative integer. So starting from 5, the number goes to left hand side with 3 plus. 5 to 4, 1 plus. 4 to 3, 2 plus. 3 to 2, 3 plus. The number now at 2. So minus 2 plus 7 plus minus 3 equal to 2. Now we solve question number 5. Question number 5 is add without using the number line using absolute value. First bit is 7 plus 5. Both are positive integers. So add these numbers without sign. 7 plus 5 is 12. And 12 is positive. Second bit B. Minus 5 plus minus 5. Absolute value. Find the absolute value of minus 5 is 5. Absolute value of minus 5 is 5 and absolute value of 5 is 5. Add the number 5 and 5 that is 10 and both are negative integers so minus 5 plus minus 5 equal to minus 10. Add the minus, minus sign before the 10 numbers so the number will be minus 10. Minus 5 plus minus 5 equal to minus 10. C. Minus 8 plus of minus 1. Both are negative integer. So absolute value of minus 8 is 8 and absolute value of minus 1 is 1. 8 plus 1 is 9 and both are negative integer negative sign. Both are negative integers. So add the negative sign with the number 9. So minus 8 plus of minus 1 equal to minus 9. D 8 plus of minus 5. Subtract 5 from 8, 8 minus 5 is 3 and big, uh, sign of the bigger number is positive. Bigger number is 8 and sign of the bigger number is positive. So 8 plus of minus 5 is 3. 3 is positive. Now question number 6. Question number 6 is insert greater than, less than or equal to symbol to make a true statement. First bit is minus 10 plus 6 dash 5 plus of minus 8. First we solve this expression in the left hand side minus 10 plus 6. Minus 10 plus 6 is minus 4. First subtract 6 from 10. 10 minus 6 is 4 and sign of the bigger number is negative. Its bigger number is 10 and sign of 10 is minus, so minus 10 plus 6 is minus 4. And now 5 plus of minus 8. 5 plus of minus 8 subtract 8, subtract 5 from 8. 8 minus 5 is 3 and bigger number is 8. 8 is greater than 5, bigger number is 8 and bigger number, sign of bigger number is negative. So the number will be 5 plus of minus 8 equal to minus 3. We get minus 10 plus 6 is minus 4 and 5 plus of minus 8 is minus 3. We know 4 is greater than 3. So minus 4 is less than minus 3. So minus 10 plus 6 is less than 5 plus of minus 8. Second bit minus 18 plus 25 dash of minus 25 plus 
18. First we solve from the left hand side expression minus 8, 18 plus 25, minus 18 plus 25, subtract, subtract 18 from 25, 25 minus 18 is 7 and bigger number is 25 and bigger number sign is positive. So minus 18 plus 25 will be 7, minus 18 plus 25 equal to 7. Now solve the right hand side expression minus 25 plus 18. Subtract 18 from 25. Uh, 25 minus 18 is 7. And sign of the bigger number is negative. H25 is negative integer. So add the negative sign before 7. So minus 25 plus 18 equal to minus 7. We know 7 is greater than minus 7. So minus 18 plus 25 is greater than minus 25 plus 18. Now solve question number 7. Question number 7 is write the additive inverse of first bit is 15. 15 is positive integer. We know additive inverse of positive integer is negative integer. So additive inverse of 15 is minus 15. B minus 6. Minus 6 is negative integer. We know additive inverse of minus uh, additive inverse of negative integer is positive integer. So additive inverse of minus 6 is 6. C, 0. 0 is neither positive nor negative integer. So, additive inverse of 0 is 0. If you have any doubts then please write in comment section and I will reply. If you have not subscribed my youtube channel please subscribe my youtube channel. Keep learning, keep watching. Thank you.